cry. Chikabia. Makes you to, to, to regret. Others have even left salvation. Because of the things that they are going through. But the Bible is very clear. You are of God, little children. And overcome them who? The devil and his demons. Because he who is in you is greater than the one who is in the world. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are still going. So the first point I am giving to you Kati, if you are going to dominate bobo nafuga, is your mind. Bongobo. Your thoughts. Ebirobozobyo. I don't need to spend much of the time with you to know who, who you are what you think. Your appearance can say it all. Or one way that comes from your mouth. Because you look like what you look at. You look like what you spend time listening to. If you think you are going to dominate when you spend time on social media, you are lying to yourself. When you are watching comedy, and you laugh the whole day, and then the next one will say, I have dominion. Dominion is all about talking it. It's not only talking about it, but it is exercising it. It is walking in it. It is living in it. Not only shouting. I have dominion. I have dominion. What have you done with the dominion that you have? Who have you changed? Who have you inspired? Praise the Lord. So your thoughts. Everything that you have today. It was somebody's thought. Do you know just sitting down and thinking is powerful? What do you do when you wake up? Of course, I'll, 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 I'll suspect you wake up, worship and pray. Then after that, what else? Let me say this to you. Change. Give yourself every day. Where were you going Time to sit down and think. Where am I going? How can I change this world? Man is hiding in ideas. And people are looking for ideas. And people pay for ideas. This flower looks so beautiful. But it's an artificial flower. God has given us fresh flowers. But somebody sat down and thought. And say, fresh flowers, they are good. But once you remove them from the plant and put them here, they cannot last for more than one week. So how do I take care of the other people who want to buy flowers and keep them for long? And looked at what God created and borrowed the idea and came up with the flower that is artificial. artificial. And the women with difference of CFC, CFC and the when they bought we and bakula, they have designed their pulpit and the church ne, looks beautiful. So whatever you are seeing or whatever you have is Uli, somebody's idea. Uli chola ba ne choina, idea you are moon too. Look at your smartphone. To know the simu yo. Somebody realized you need a phone that you can connect with other people. And you need a phone that not only for pictures, but you can do a lot of research. You can even write your notes. And to make life easier, they even put a Bible. They know that they are also Christians who want to read their Bible. And all this has been put by somebody's idea. And you walk in the shop, you pay one million. Or two million, or three million, or four hundred thousand. I don't 
know and you get that form. But what are you paying? Somebody starts. So, so what is in your mind? If you are going to dominate, what is in your mind? There are people who have no time to think. They are only thinking, how do I steal that person? They only think, how do I paint that person? One time we went somewhere with Bishop. I think it was Africana Hotel. And it was prayer breakfast. They invited a certain man from the US. And this man was talking, there were religious leaders and, and, and uh, member of parliament, so many people. And he was like, let me say this to one or two people who are here. A rich person and a poor person, they all have equal time. 24 hours a day. But the difference is the rich person will sit down and say, How do I make money in this 24 hours? And then the poor one will say, How do I get someone who can help me in this 24 hours? Someone is thinking, how do I make money? Someone is thinking, how do I beg? But both have 24 hours. All of us here, we have 24 hours. Tell your neighbor, the choice is yours. A thought is a creative energy. There is no way you can exercise dominion if you cannot think. The whole universe was, is governed by, by laws. Genesis, two, eight, Genesis 8 verse 22. Uh, Genesis 8 22. So you can't dominate if you cannot think. And don't think for, 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 for the whole year, say, I'm thinking. To People ask you, what are you doing nowadays? I'm thinking. You have no idea, you're still thinking. Think and do something. Everything is in an order of law uh, in the universe, a uh, universal. Praise the name of the Lord. So you need to think. Think of something that has your name on it. When you go on social, when you go on, uh, on Google or social media, there are names that even when you don't know them, they come out, they pop out. Why? Why? They are already dominating. They have done something. Tell your neighbor, the world has no time for nobody. Even yeah. the devil himself has no time for nobody. Many people are accusing the devil. If it wasn't the devil, I would have done this. The devil says, excuse me, I don't know your address. The devil himself no time for nobody. And everybody you are admiring, they have done something so that you can admire them. Because Even the Bible says, think on these things. Think on these things. What are you thinking about? What is in your mind? What are you spending time thinking about? Thinking about how do you destroy somebody's marriage? How is it going to help you? Thinking about somebody's dress, how is it going to help you? Whatever you are seeing, somebody's idea. Even the car you are driving, somebody's idea. So where is your idea? Remember God has done his part. He said, let them have dominion. And the Bible said that 
the heaven belongs to God. But the earth belongs to a children of men. So we have the power to change this whole world. We have the right to put things right. Because we represent God. We are his ambassadors. When they describe about heaven, they say heaven is beautiful. I believe God is expecting us to have a beautiful world which is governed by, the, by his children, us who are born again. Because we are representing him. But you can imagine the children of God are the ones running to the people of the world to beg. Tell a neighbor, I'm a king. I'm a child of God. I am not a beggar, but I am a giver. God is expecting us to help people in the world. Who are you going to change? If you do not have even 5,000 to help a poor man on the street. Look in your family. You, you don't contribute. Whenever they have a function, you don't contribute. Why? Because you don't have. But you want to say, I dominate. Na I reign. Na yato ya I want you to know God. Which God are you telling them if you cannot help them? Children of God, it's time to rise up. Isaiah 60 verse 1 Say, arise and shine for your glory has come. Bishop said the theme, it's the time. Bishop Yagambia Mutokun on Tikase. As I sang, arise and shine. Isaya Gamba Goloko Koya. For your glory has come. Tell a neighbor, it's time to rise up. It's time to stand in our position. You can only speak with authority. When Authority has been given to you. And when you are in the right position. That's why I told you we are starting with your mind. Stop criticizing people. Don't spend time and looking for who has failed, who has made you to fail. Think how you can change. I want to dominate. But for me to dominate, what do I need? Number one, you need God. After God, you need knowledge of what you are going to dominate. Your mind. And the words are your. How you think. You criticize everybody. Poor people. I'm sorry to say. Poor people. Are always looking of how to criticize. Do you think they can even talk about us, those ones? It's all about them. They have it all. They can show off. You are wasting time. Instead of thinking how you can improve yourself and become better. Rich people have no time. It is actually poor people who take gossip to the rich people. Because rich people are always chasing ideas. How they can become better. How can they start this? How they can go to China to bring this? They are strategizing. A poor one is strategizing how to get 10,000 from that person. Time wasted. Nothing achieved. Tell yourself, I am not created to be a beggar. 
I am not the one to run to look for help. Since they I, will run to me to look for help. Tell yourself I'm blessed. Say I'm blessed. In the name of Jesus. Do you know rich people are a blessing? They help the orphans. They help the widows. They help the church. Tell your neighbor, I'm one of them. I am a blessing. And I'll make sure that I'll be a blessing to somebody. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So we talked about our minds. Thinking. Number two, association. If you are to dominate. Association. Association. Who do you spend time with? You spend time with people who don't believe in themselves. You spend time with people who don't believe in education. You spend time with people who don't believe in anything good. All they do is to complain. All they do is to complain. All they do is to criticize. That's what they do. They will never change your mind. Who do you associate with? There is power in association. The company you keep. The people that have surrounded you. Surround yourself with people who are better than you. Don't be in a place where you are the only king there. You will never learn anything. Be with people that are better. That's when you look at them. Say, how do I reach there? When they talk, you cop ideas. When you, move them, when you move with them, you are seeing how they live their lives. But only you want people whom you are better than. But what do you have a bicycle? Everybody you are with, they have nothing. And you feel comfortable. It's time to move with those who have Bentley. Who have better cars. Bentley. And you have a border border. And you are with them. How did they manage to reach here? Power of association. Who is in your car? Company. Who is speaking to you? Who is challenging you? You need people who can show you the way. This is how you reach there. Not everybody there, you are the only one who knows it better. But you have never been at airport. You have never flown anywhere. But you are the best. Everybody there, they admire you. Because you have been at a cashier more. So they admire you. Ah, ah, you need those ones who have been in Australia. Who are, who are informed. Glory be to God. Power of association. There are some relationships that you don't need. Relationships do expire. They are also good. Nunji. But you need to know who do you befriend. Some relationships do expire. And wake up and say bye. This is what I want now. That's why I started saying start with the thought, with the mind. Who do you want to be? Where are you going? Then when you realize the surroundings, the company that I am with cannot take me anywhere. It's time to say bye and look for better friends. Like I said earlier, I want to look like what you look at. Who are you looking at? If you don't want to change, remain where you are. If you want to change, turn around and look for people who are achievers. People who have testimonies. People who have names. God gives riches. God blesses people. Don't listen to the lie of the devil that all rich people, they have done something wrong to reach where they are. My brother, my sister, there are people who are loaded, who are 
received everything from God. God has blessed them. They have killed nobody. They have sacrificed nobody. They have walked with God. They have trusted God. They have believed God. And God has changed their lives. Who told you the devil has riches? You see everybody rich, ah, they have slaughtered something. Ah, they sacrificed somebody. That's why they are like this. No, some people is God given. God has blessed them. They look at the left, they are rich. They look at the right, they are rich. And when they remember, they benefit the kingdom of God. I pray for you this afternoon that may you be one of the people God is going to remember this conference. May God bless you financially. May God bless you financially. May you become wealthy. May you smell money everywhere you go. Amen. Rich people speak with authority. They don't shout a lot. Bishop always makes us laugh, but it's very true. Bishop says you can all be in the meeting. And you are busy raising your hand, they are ignoring you. Let a rich man walk in when you are even late. And without even raising a hand, you know. <laughs> Before we finish, let us ask Mr. Elder Sekama to speak. But he has even come late. When everybody is seated, everybody wants to go. And you speak for one hour and everybody is the one paying the venue. Is the one paying the water you are drinking. You have no choice. Authority. May God give you money. In the name of Jesus. It's time to have dominion over the earth. As a child of God, even in your family, it's time to raise you up. That when you speak, they hear. You know everybody can speak but not everybody hears. Everybody has a mouth. We can all speak. But the question who is hearing? You are moving from the level of just talking to a level when you speak. They hear. The Bible said Sarah spoke. And God said to Abraham, listen to your wife Sarah. You can talk and people listen. But when God has elevated you when God has anointed you and you are dominating you speak and they listen I pray for you this afternoon that you will not make noise but you speak and they listen what are you waiting for? Your generation is waiting for him. It's time for you to rise up and do something with your life. This shoe I'm putting on, all of you have shoes here. Look at your shoe. Somebody sat down and said, There are women who like heels. Doesn't matter how tall they are, they still want to be in heels. So they created the heels for them. And we put it and you put the no. somebody's idea. Rise up and do something with your life. You can't complain and complain and think complain will change your life. Actually, when you start living a life of complaining, you grow old very fast. Because you'll have wrinkles. Every time you are stressed, mm. Mm. you get frustrated, you get old, oh. and you get sick. At the end of the day, we say bye. 
So tell your neighbor, I will not waste time Gamba, to get stressed, but I put my time to think how I can change this world. May God give me ideas. Give me the anointing. Give me the grace. My generation is waiting. I pray for you this afternoon that you are a generational changer. You are a history maker. You want to change the history of your family. You want to change your generation. I pray for you as we're ending this service. That may the Lord anoint you and give you wisdom that at the end of the day you'll have a product after your name. You can't talk of dominion if your mindset is not changed. Politics is not of the devil. Ask the children of God who have the wisdom and the anointing. We are supposed to take those strategic positions. And we represent God. And we speak the mind of God. Take your seat. There is an article which is moving on social media, circulating on social media. Talking about how homosexuals have taken over schools. And that cannot happen at Kingdom Jewels. That's why you need to bring your children at Kingdom Jewels. Rest assured. Christian foundation with no compromise. But the devil has taken over. Using money. They go in schools and identify somebody there. It doesn't matter how young they are. And they give them a lot of money. And they initiate our innocent children. Then after prayer, after we have prayed, then what? Prayer alone cannot change that. Prayer alone but being in a strategic position where you have the voice to speak. The children of God have become voiceless because we are nowhere. We can't even support one another to say, okay, if me, I'm not going to stand. You is going to stand. We're going to give you the vote. No. We rather vote for the secular world. Not our own people. We are the only army that fight our own wounded soldiers. We don't support one another. And that is not godly. If you can't do it, then support the one who can do it. So that at least we are represented. Now in America, it's not even a debate. They have legalized abortion. You can abort. They don't even debate about it. Because the devil's people are sitting in high positions. And they are not shouting. They use a pen. As small as it is. Put a signet. And it's done. And the church. We break them. We fight them. Woo! As you are praying and fasting, they are prospering. They are succeeding. They are doing whatever they are doing to push the devil's agenda. Don't think I hate prayer. I'm one person who loves prayer because my life is prayer. But let me tell you, there are certain things that does not need prayer. No. We have prayed for everything. And things are going back. But we are praying. That means prayer is not enough. We need to enter there. It needed an Esther to be in the palace. 
not only speaking in tongues, but Esther needed to be there to represent the Jews. The Bible said she went for prayer and she told her maid servants to pray. But also she did a strategy. What strategies do church have? When I'm saying church, I'm talking about you. Church, church is not we. a building. Church, church is you. Church is you. We have complained. We have talked. We have prayed. We have not acted. It's time se to have dominion. And not only to shout dominion, but to exercise dominion. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. So it is in our mind. We need to think. That's why I told you when you wake up, don't only pray after prayer good, but also sit down and think. How do I benefit my generation? How do I change my family? How do I change my everything? May we rise up on our feet. We are going to pray. God has given us dominion. We are going to pray. God will give us the strategies. God is going to give us all the tools that we need to dominate. Because it is our time. It is our season. I want to tell yourself, it is my time. It is my season. I am rising up on my feet to do something with my life. In the name of Jesus, lift up your hands towards heaven and begin to pray. Say, Father, touch my mind. Touch my arm, Lord. Touch my mind, Lord. You say in your word, let them have dominion. And they want the theme this year says, it's time to have dominion. This is my time, Lord. This is my season, Lord. This is my hour, Lord. It's time to exercise dominion. It's time to have dominion. It's time to live in what God has said. Begin to pray. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. In the name of Jesus. For this team, Lord, that is here to challenge us, to challenge our minds, to challenge our ideas, to challenge our thoughts. Father, anoint us. Anoint us, Lord. Pray for the anointing. This conference, there is an anointing to reign, anointing to rule. Anointing to govern. There is an anointing in this conference. Receive the anointing. Anointing to dominate. Anointing to dominate. You will dominate at your workplace. You will dominate at your workplace. You will dominate in that university. You will dominate in that business. I see your company rising. I see the hand of God is upon you. In everything you do, you will prosper. You will succeed. The hand of God is upon you. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I pray for you that you'll be wealthy. In the name of Jesus. Where great names will be mentioned. I pray for you this afternoon. That your name will be mentioned. I pray for you this now, this evening. That this generation will not omit your name. In the name of Jesus. Celebrate Jesus in the house. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's time to tell yourself you can make it. It's time to tell yourself it doesn't matter which place. By the mercy and the grace of God, I will enter. Some of you after this conference, you'll be amazed the way you'll be passionate about business. 
You'll be passionate about politics. You'll be passionate to start something. Because this conference there's an anointing to dominate in all areas. Spiritually, you must dominate. The devil, we must put him where he belongs. The battle was won 2,000 years ago. Why is the demons dominating you? The ignorant of the scriptures. Why are you not in the strategic positions? Ignorant of everything. You think the world stops where you are. Mm -hmm. The world does not stop where you are. Look around, the building is full with people. So you think if the world stops where you are, you're sitting room, your children and the world has ended, you are lying. Look around, every head here comes from somewhere. And as us who are here very small like this, think about Uganda at large, very big. It has a head of state. Then think about the Africa continent. Then think about the whole world. So why are you remaining where you are? It's time to rise up. It's time to come out from the comfort zone. Let's challenge our minds. Let's represent God in a right way. Put your hands for Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Two more things I'm going to do before I sit down. Of course, I'm coming back one of the days in the name of Jesus. This is just the introduction. Can you take your seat? If you are here and you're not born again, please give your life to Christ. The best decision you can do for yourself if you are to dominate, give your life to Christ in the name of Jesus. As you are making your way to front, this annual minister's conference, the 27th, has started today. We have Seven more days to go. I want us to put our hands together and celebrate God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Isn't the pulpit look so beautiful? Isn't it looking so beautiful? Ah, uh, uh, what's wrong with you? Let's put our hands together and appreciate the designing team. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And of course, our man of God was behind these ideas. Thank you so much, Bishop, for being so classy. You know me, I like classy things. When I entered, I said, God, it's time for us to build our cafe. If we can do this in a temporary church, how about in the permanent church? You need to pray from here forever. And you don't need to die now. So that you can see what is ahead. It's time to dominate. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. We want to appreciate you so much. But to do all these things, brothers and sisters, it takes a lot of money. This conference is an international conference. We have visitors from from Ghana, Nigeria, Nigeria South, Africa, South Africa, and our very own Ugandans. All these men of God are coming here to minister to us. Eight days we are going to be here. Every day. First of all, you need to attend. Invite somebody. Don't miss it for anything. At this moment, I want you to stand up on your feet. Come and pick an envelope. If you took an envelope for conference support, bring it now. If you have cash with you, bring it right now in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for this envelope that men and women are going to pick to support the conference. Father, as they do so, bless them abundantly in the name of Jesus. Increase their finances. Open those that no money can shut. Give them ideas. Give them anointing. Give them grace to dominate 
yet in every area. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Kindly run in front and come and pick an envelope. Conference support. I know you have given already, but we need a lot of money. If you have not given, you'll be the first to run here and pick an envelope. The opportunity is still there for you to give. Let's stand up on our feet. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Please come. I want to thank, I want to appreciate women in a different and special way. Let's put our hands together for them. Women with difference. Thank you for all that you have done. I'll mention later. God bless you. The men of excellence. Thank you so much. God bless you. The praise and worship team. Praise and worship team. God bless you. The security department. Security department. The ushering department. Ushering department. Hospitality. Hospitality. Protocol. Protocol. Kingdom media. Kingdom media. Focus media. Focus media. Teens department. Teens department. Sunday school department. Sunday school. Pastoral board. Pastoral board. Everybody. Feel a Appreciated. The interpreters, the intercessors, everybody, God bless you. May I have envelopes, please? Okay. okay, thank you. The challenge you are not telling me how much you are bringing. That's the only challenge I have. You have 10,000, 20,000, 50,000, come and drop it to the pulpit. Conference is here Conference and it's already on and there are things we are still handling here and there. Can I, can I ask you something that I want us to do in this conference? How many of you say this podium does not suit here anymore? The way the church looks. How many if you say, ah, ah, no, raise your hand. I'm one of them. We need a glass podium here as soon as tomorrow. Who is giving me money? Last time I checked, it was 2M. But right now, it must be 2.5 3M. Please, we can't talk of dominating and we are not givers. Create a reason why God should give you the anointing to dominate financially. So that you benefit the kingdom of God. Bishop, how much are you giving me? Bishop, I start with my husband. Ah, uh, uh, no. As Bishop said 200, I have refused. Bishop, I take an envelope to Bishop, I can't take 200 from the man of God. Bishop, ah, uh, no. Mommy has gone. Doctor, ah no, not to her, not to her, no. <laughs> Doctor, mention figures, add zeros. You get a code zero. <laughs> Elder Jarrett, second, because I'm going to mention your name because you don't want to say it. Captain Moviru, please come with your wife. Matthias, please come. I'm going to mention your names. We need to podium by tomorrow. Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. Cash, that one has gone. I'll take it, but you add. He has given me 100,000. Finance committee, this is not your money. Finance committee Don't look at it. My daughter, come. We are going to work together. Share lady, come. Have the basket. How much are you giving me? This money I'm putting in your hands. You're going to buy the, the podium. Zoe, my lovely girl, thank you so much. God bless you. 100,000. We need a podium by tomorrow. $100. God bless you. I'm surrounded with rich daughters. 500,000. At night. God bless you. Please bring money a podium. Yes, for podium. Eh? God bless you. Yes, my son Eddie. 200,000. I want it today. Or tomorrow. Please come. Envelope. God bless you. God bless you. That is from the, the Mugurus. Salonga <laughs> Nala. No. I need more money. Go and add it. All this. Bishop Chiganda, Dr. DL Salongo. God bless you. 300. God bless you. Yes, Ms. Aurita. Ms. Aurita. Can you please mention? No. 100 from you? No. Take an envelope and go and put money. Choir, what is going on there? Why are you quiet? 
Everybody here you are going to give money okay? We need a glass podium by tomorrow In the name of Jesus Why are you quiet? Because they are called the choir They need to give money Should I miss that to mention your name? Maybe we are on TV Thank you Pastor Narada Grace Yes Sister Joy uh -huh. A hundred. Joy, you didn't mention that is cheating. You could come back. Uh huh. One hundred fifty. God bless you. Thank you so much. We are buying this podium. This one, uh, we don't want it anymore. It's no longer in our class. Can I start to mention your names because I need to leave this place? Do you know what it is to stand here with these heels? <laughs> But I'm a woman with difference. Uh -huh. 100,000. God bless you. Thank you so much. The podium. Katut. Chairman, we are bringing the podium. Chairman, Katut. Hey, how about you, darling? She said I should not mention. She has mentioned a lot of money. Let me keep quiet. I was going to call your name. Thank God you have come. Uh huh. God bless you. Put it there. Thank you so much. Come up, um, sir. Madam Christine Naiga, I need a podium here. You and Elder Sekam, a podium here. So if the man is not enough, you add the two of you. So you better pray for me, people, to give me money. Sir, thank you so much. God bless you. We appreciate you. Elder Sekam is already speaking in tongues. And Madam Christine, so that the money is enough. Josh, how much are you bringing? How can you buy podium and you are not buying? Come and tell me how much are you bringing. If you don't have, go there. You are coming. Come and drop here. He's in university, but he's a giver. Drop there. God will give you. Amen. Thank you. Uh -huh. Who else? I'm calling you. Please come. Whoever I've seen Nakato, tell her to come and give us money. If you don't see her, please go there. Uh -huh. Yes. Wow. You know, having rich people in the house, it is very good. May God give us money, all of us. Do you know what he has told me? Mommy, don't stress yourself. You are sweating. You have preached very well. Just count how much is there. And the remaining five we are going to clear. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Thank you so much. God bless you. Ah, doctors. Dr. Mike, Dr. Fortunate, these are doctors. They should give me some money. Even though, even though five stars cleared. You see, when the podium is here, you know my money is there. So how can you look at the podium and your money is not there? Just make your way in front and drop money there. Pastor Zion, don't even look at me with that innocent look. Please put money there. Can we stand up on our feet? In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm also going to put money there. Uh, the podium cannot be bought without my money. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's all stand up on our feet. If you want to give your life to Christ, make your way to front. I want you to know that we are coming back. Right now we are going for lunch. And then we come back for the evening session. And every day, we are here. Please come for the conference. Invite somebody. These men and women are coming from different parts of the world to come and bless us. By the end of the conference, some people will need an appointment to see you. Put your hands together and welcome Bishop Dr. D. Chiganda to come and close the service in the name of Jesus. Amen. Here, let's put our hands together for Pastor Cindy. Wow. Wow. It is really time to have dominion over the earth. Over the earth. 
If you have dominion on this earth, whatever that is on earth shall bow unto you. It is it that has been seeking them. They begin to seek you. It is it that has been bowing up to them. They will begin to bow unto you. Because you have authority over them. Whatever you have been bowing unto, they will begin to bow unto you. When the Pharaoh declared Joseph as the prime minister, what do you have? Somebody listening to me, Pharaoh. When he fell, prime minister, declared Joseph as the prime minister of this nation. Mukama we Potiphar, his master Potiphar, ayamugula mukatari. That brought him from the marketplace. And took him to his home to work as a houseboy. Never had any choice. But to stand and salute him. Say I salute you Afandi. Who is saying who? Who is saluting you who? Who was saluting you? Who was saluting the other? Who was bowing unto the other? When dominion comes back to you, whatever you used to bow unto, it shall bow unto you. Whatever you used to seek, shall seek you in rebuke. Whatever you used to command, you shall command. Shout unto Jesus, say, Thank you, Lord. May the God overturn whatever you have been bowing unto you. They may bow unto you. You may speak you may seek him, but may seek him. Raise up your hand. Say, oh Lord, thank you for today. I've started this conference where I want to participate fully in it together with useful anointing. By the time I leave this place, whatever I used to bow unto, when they are bowing unto me, people I used to seek, when they are the ones seeking me, people I used to admire, when they are the ones admiring me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I want to thank you so much for coming. Pastor Khan is coming from the rural area. Thank you for joining us. Pastor Khan is coming from the rural area. Thank you for joining us. Pastor Khan is coming from the rural area. Thank you for Together with pastors that have come, they are not missed the evening session. We have delayed a little bit, but at 3:30 we shall begin. Okay, we shall start again. 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 Okay, we shall of all the singers coming from so many places. We have prepared a presentation. The guests of honor are coming here at 4.30. You shouldn't uh, miss the beginning. Because it's so important to begin with the word of the when you were there when it's beginning. May God bless you. If you know your place is far where you reside, you have a mindset that you Tukwa kusoka kuda ye bombo ndiye meri Nida Sende zubado kundi kulinya mwe moroko Gende bombo Genda na mwe restaurant Yoko mpi mpi Zidiye mwe meri Weto lolo Kome omu conference Otule Boleva chigana Nge mbira kwe kutapo kilangana Uji tapo kilangu Uji gamba katikali Nsiriye Echijia chijie Yes Don't spend money Going back to the village Or bombo to eat food Just use the money You have used for transport To have food If the worst comes The worst you say I'm fasting But I want to attend The evening session Mwola angida kansibe Echijia chijie Say come what may in let me pass. Kali, chisa chamu kama fesu Kristu. Okuwa gada kope aikatonda. Okuse chumwa kuma yego mtukufu. Bibere na fefena. Naburuganda bonda. Emine mejita guwao. Amina. Ah.
Ayagalo kuroko kati tukwela bidedu ke misele jangua na roko ke Mubanga tuna roko ka If you want to get born again please come and get born again Kubanto ina bogenda kufuga bintunga tegwe tuna roko ka jangua roko ke roko ke Ovide kunguru Eba debi kufuga olioko bifuge There is no way you can dominate over things over the earth when you are born again Mukama bampe na mkisa May God bless you Sawa Sawa muenda na chitunu zinjini tukenda kubata andise wano Exactly through 30 we shall have begun here Elate we unyanga wano Kuchetuti abatu wabu juli zimuba genda genda maso Aba imbi ba genda genda maso Gwe weto rodemu katono muenda kitundu ngo ingida Zabi kemi pira Just get ready at 3.30 we shall begin off Aba agado kuloko kamde kemi sinde mwje wano If you want to get born again please hurry up to the front Au, awamu na uruganda There Na baba deba agu abagado kuma wiri mokama na mwemu anguwe If you had backslid and you want to return back unto God please hurry up to the front Mokama agrumezwenyo May God be glorified Hallelujah 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 Glory be to God Echiti wa chidide mokama Glory be Ona yagala kurokoka This one wants to get born again Omule daliwa yagala kurokoka yangu wajewa norokoke Yangu wajewa norokoke If you want to get born again please come and join this Now abade yagwa Now abade yagwa If you had backslid, now we are there. We are going to go. Come here, we are If you had backslid, come back and to go. We are going to go and take him and come and do If you have reached here, raise up your hands. Amasu kazibiri zee odemwe bigambo bino. Close up your eyes and answer this one. Gamant ayesu. Ayesu. Mokama wange. Mokama wange. Na kuruwalero. Na kuruwalero. Zijia masogo. Zijia masogo. Na kwe gaidida. Kwe gaidida. Onsasire. Onsasire. Onsonyewe. Onsonyewe. Ebibi biangebi onda. 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 Mwanya gang, mchita wacha ba fu, oga wandi ike, mchita wacha ba damu, bangorwa dero, bangorwa dero, zeno mti magwani, doko se, doko se, doko se, muri nyeri ya Yesu, Yesu unkweva za, bangor ndoko de, ndo kuvadero, di muro kore, muri nyeri ya Yesu, Amina, kade mungole mi kono tupa sabire, raise up your hands and we pray for this, imiri do mungole mi kono sabire ba bantu bana, stand up and raise up these hands and we pray. The heavenly Father, Lord, the lives forever. The unsearchable God. We bring these children before you. May you have mercy. Forgive them. And the righteous names. Whatever they did. Whatever they did. Whatever they did. Have mercy. Forgive. Wash with the blood. Give them a chance. Give them power. To walk with the righteous names. Wangura biona, ebiwa ebiwa wangura. Mori nyeri ya Yesu. Amen. Amen. Ani agendo genda na ba yugere muna woko. Anybody going with them to speak with them? Oh, yoruganda. Oh, yoruganda. Oya agenda kugera na mwe mumo goberere. Follow up that brother. We are, we are, we are. Wani komo kono makula beso. Aya gara kugera kona mwe. Amen. Come on, Glory be to God. Glory be to God. God bless you all. Ali mu soundi, soundi. Eto we music atu sivola. Amen. Sa mwenda nekundungo tu demu chifo 